Welcome to Sofa Saturday, which is not on a sofa because somebody didn't clean their bedroom. So we're having to do it in here today. <clears throat> and I have a sore throat. And Christopher's really thrilled about filming this video today, aren't you? No. Okay. Anyway. There. Would you rather be a reverse censure or a reverse mermaid merman? Centaur. Centaur. What? Well, I'm not a centaur. Okay. <clears throat> so would you rather be a reverse centaur or a reverse merman? Reverse. So if you see a merman or a mermaid, they usually have a fish tail, don't they? And a human body. So, and a centaur is half horse, half man. So, would you rather it be the other or way around? Like a horse head. Yeah. And a human. Yeah. Or a mermaid fish head and human legs. <laughs> a reverse centaur. Yeah, me too. <clears throat> Would you rather have constantly dry eyes or a constant runny nose? I'd rather have dry eyes. I never had dry eyes. It's like when you really when they're really tight when you're really tired and they're itchy and dry. Oh yeah. That's really annoying though. If you got so is a runny nose, you'd be constantly going <laughs> oh, yeah, I'd rather have dry eyes. <laughs> Would you rather be a famous director or a famous actor? Mm. Famous actor. Mm, me too. Famous actor. Would you rather not be able to open any closed doors, locked or unlocked, or not be able to close any open doors? Mm. That is a really weird question. Why would you want to not be able to open doors? I'd rather not be able to close, close any open doors. doors. What if someone's chasing you though? And you need to close the door. And you can't. You hide behind the door just go like that. Oh, okay. And then you beat them up. Well, yeah, I'd rather not... Because I, I, I don't want to be able to not open doors. That's a really stupid question. How would you get out of your house? You'd have to leave your house door open. Open all the time. But how would you open it in the first place? What do you mean? <laughs> well, doesn't it? I'm confused. Because if you can't ever open, if you can't open closed doors, how are you supposed to get out of your house? Or into your house in the first place? It says close open doors. No, would you rather not be able to open any closed I chose <coughs> that Oh one. yeah, I know, but I'm just saying. I was talking about that one that you'd have to leave the okay. door open all the time. <clears throat> Would you rather give up all drinks except for water or give up eating anything that was cooked in an oven? I would rather well i only drink well i don't only drink water but i drink a lot of water anyway so i don't want to give up food yeah so i'd give up all drinks except for water yeah mm -hmm. would you rather be constantly tired no matter how much you sleep or constantly hungry no matter what you eat assuming that there are no health problems besides the feeling of hunger and sleepiness I'd rather feel tired no matter how much sleep. Oh god, I don't know which one, because both of those things, if I don't have sleep or food, make me irritable. So to feel... No, so you wouldn't feel anything apart from hunger or sleepiness? Mm. You need to listen to the question. <laughs> <laughs> you need to listen to the question. I would rather feel hungry. I'd rather feel sleepy, so I really do. That's because you don't get enough sleep though. 
What time did you go to sleep last night? Two-ish. Would you rather have to read aloud every word you read or sing everything you say out loud? Sing everything you say out loud. Everything you say out loud. Read aloud everything. Would you rather? We're keeping you up. <laughs> Would you rather have whatever you are thinking appear above your head for everyone to see, or have absolutely everything you do live streamed for anyone to see? Ugh. Um, I would ha I would have ev everything, absolutely everything I do live stream because you've got more control over that. Yeah. Because you can think some really horrible things, can't you, without actually yeah. wanting to think them. Would you rather be put in a maximum security federal prison with the hardest of the hardened criminals for one year, or be put in a relative route? relatively relaxed prison where Wall Street types are held for 10 years. Hmm. I think, well, I think I'd go for the 10 years because you're more likely to die in the maximum security prison, aren't you? And you're more likely to become involved in, um, things, naughty things, even though it's, because in a year, a lot can happen in a year. A lot can happen in ten years. Yeah, but you're, but they're only, like, they're not murderers and really bad criminals, they're like fraud and that kind of stuff. You have to choose one. A year. Ten years is a long time. It is, but you might get um might get off half half your sentence off for good behaviour. It's only five years. Be fine. Would you rather have a clown only you can see? Oh my god, that makes me go all shivery. That follows you everywhere and just stands silently in a corner watching you without doing or saying anything. Oh my god, that is horrible. Or have a real life stalker who dresses like the Easter Bunny that everyone can see. <sighs> the Easter Bunny. That colour. Oh my god, I don't like, like that. It's horrible. Right there, <laughs> oh, it. oh no. I'd rather have the Easter Bunny. Me too. No, because with the clown you could have something. Oh god, don't. It's you punch me... it in the face, <laughs> like in the nose, it goes. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. Would you rather kill one innocent person or five who committed minor crimes? Need more background information on that. I mean, how minor are these minor crimes? <clears throat> um, how old are they? And um, then I'll kill one innocent person because I think that's easier to come to terms with. Because if you kill five people, you've got all their families as well to think about. At least with the one mm. person, you've only got one family to think about. Are you going for the one? Yeah. Would you rather have a completely automated home or a self driving car? I would have. I would like the automated home. And it does everything. For you. Everything, yeah. Everything's controlled. Doors, cups of tea, shower, TV. You just talk oh, to it. Stairs, if you want. If you want. <laughs> yeah, an automated home. I like it. Would you rather work very hard at a? rewarding job or hard or hardly have to work at a job that isn't rewarding i'd rather work very hard at a rewarding job yeah me too 
Would you rather be held in high regard by your parents or your friends? High regard for Zoom. Like, they think they know, they think the best of you. So would you rather your parents think the best of you or your friends think the best of you? I don't, I'd, well, you want both, don't you? Um, I would say probably my friends because my parents, they're going to think the best of you no matter what. Friends. Where, where are we? Would you rather be an amazing painter or a brilliant mathematician? A brilliant mathematician. Yeah, me so too. Pay I'm terrible at maths, so it'd be good. That'd be good. Would you rather be reincarnated as a fly or just cease to exist after you die? I'd rather come back as a fly. You wouldn't live five minutes. Of course I would. They're so annoying that they don't really. And I'd stay away. I wouldn't annoy people. I'd just like crawl you around. Know not to. I'd, be, I'd be really skulky. You wouldn't know not to. I would because I'd still know. I'd know that I've been reincarnated as a fly. And I think, wow, flies are really annoying. So I'm just going to sit here and watch what's going on. I'd go fly around the world. A fly then. <laughs> That's fair. Oh. Would you rather be able to go to any theme park in the world for free for the rest of your life or eat for free at any drive through restaurant for the rest of your life. Go to any theme park for free for the rest of your yeah, life. Yeah, me too. Definitely. Oh, and tell us, yeah. <laughs> Would you rather be only able to watch the few movies with a Rotten tomato score of 95 to 100% or only be able to watch the majority of movies with a Rotten tomato score of 94% and lower. What do you mean by a Rotten tomato score? That's like, I think that's bad ratings that they get. I don't really know Rotten Tomatoes that well. The few movies. I don't, I don't know, because I don't really understand the whole premise around Rotten Tomatoes. I, I think it's not a good thing. Oh well, skip it. Skip it. Would you rather never lose your phone again, or never lose your keys again? My keys. A phone. But if you lose your phone. But if I lose this phone, I don't get an iPhone 6. And iPhone. if you lose that phone, yeah, you just have no phone ever again. <coughs> but it's easier for me to ring up a phone company or to go on that Google thing and block my phone completely. I can't block my keys, can I? Just change the locks. Yeah, but it's a lot more difficult on your car. And it's a fast to change locks, isn't it? Would you rather have one real get out of jail free card or a key that opens any door? Ooh, I want the jail free just, card. Is that a key that will just open one door like, and that's it? Or as many doors as you want? I presume it, as any door, as many doors as you want. But if you have a key that opens any door, that's basically a jail get out of free card because you just open your cell door. Yeah, but then it wouldn't. Oh, yeah, it would. Yeah, but they'd still be on the run. So you'd be constantly thinking, oh, am I going to get caught? At least if you've got your. And then you could use the get out of jail free card. Like, yeah. You can't have both. <laughs> I think I'd have the get out of jail free card because then I could. I don't know, I'd do something. If you had two, you use one, and then you go up in authority, so it's like, eh, I got out for the free, and then they put back in jail, and you just do it again to get out. So it's 
So are you choosing the key or the jail free? The jail free. Okay. Did I read that or you? Me. Would you rather have one... No, I've just, you've just read that. <laughs> Would you rather have a criminal justice system that actually worked and is fair or an administrative government that is free of corruption? Uh, can you explain it? Right, so a crim the criminal justice system is flawed in many ways, isn't it? Because people get different sentences for different things. It doesn't really work. It doesn't stop people committing crime, does it? Even for people that have the death penalty. It doesn't stop people doing things. And then the other one about the government is basically a government that is fair and just and honest and open instead of saying a lot of stuff that's not going to happen, that they don't really... They're not going to do a government that's actually fair and open. Okay. Hmm. It's not really understanding at the moment. Well, I think I'd go for the criminal justice system one. Mm -hmm. Right, so this will be our last one. Which one? 82. Would you rather have Would you rather have real political power but be relatively poor or be ridiculously rich and have no political power? I'd rather be ridiculously rich and no political power. Would you rather have real political power but be relatively poor? That's a bit of a weird question. If you have political power you'll be rich, will you? Yeah, I don't... Some of these questions have been a bit weird. But, um, in any case, I'm going to go for the ridiculously rich option. Then I can just buy my political power. <laughs> okay. We are done. Thank you. We shall see you next week on a sofa, maybe. If somebody learns to tidy his bedroom and stop it from smelling. Maybe open a window because it stinks. Thanks. Bye.